Today is a historic day for the fight against Alzheimer's disease. It is the first time that a potential disease-modifying treatment for Alzheimer's, one that addresses not only the clinical decline of the patient, but also the underlying mechanism of the disease, has been filed with the FDA. This is an important milestone, not only for Biogen, but also for the whole Alzheimer's community. For Alzheimer's has been one of the most challenging areas of biomedical research. So today I am filled with hope for all of us, but more importantly for all of the patients out there, for their families, their caregivers, who've been waiting for so long for a potential treatment against Alzheimer's disease. I could not be more proud of the Biogen team and our collaborators for their persistence and their determination. I'm extremely grateful for all those patients and their clinicians who've taken part into this research program to bring us to this point. Biogen has always had a deep and unwavering focus on patients. 15 years ago, Biogen expanded our reach into neurology by focusing on areas of high and met need. For example, stroke, ALS, Parkinson's disease, and indeed Alzheimer's disease. In 2007, Biogen announced an agreement with Neuromune for the development and commercialization of a novel, fully human antibody that binds to amyloid for the potential treatment of Alzheimer's disease. In 2014, Biogen further expanded our commitment to Alzheimer's disease by entering into a collaboration with ASI Pharmaceuticals for the development and commercialization of two additional clinical candidates for the potential treatment of Alzheimer's disease. Alzheimer's disease is a high-risk proposition in biomedical research. The failure rate is high. The risks are very high. This is the reason why many companies have abandoned the field, not Biogen. Biogen remains committed to finding effective treatments that address high unmet medical needs in neuroscience. This is our mission. This is who we are as Biogen. Early identification and early diagnosis of patients is a major challenge in Alzheimer's today. It's important that effective tools are available and affordable so that patients could be identified early in the disease, either in the preclinical stage or in the early Alzheimer's stage. Due to the progressive nature of Alzheimer's disease, it is in the early stages of the disease that intervention has the best chance of success, whether it is behavioral modification or putting together the care team and the drug treatment that are going to help slow disease progression. Other challenges include the lack of urgency in detecting and caring for patients who suffer from Alzheimer's, the emotional distress that goes with Alzheimer's disease that patients and their family members go through. And finally, the stigma and misperceptions associated with Alzheimer's. So to address these barriers, we must work collaboratively with other stakeholders so that together we will help diagnose, identify patients, educate the community, and ultimately provide effective treatment for these patients who suffer from Alzheimer's disease.